hello everyone good morning welcome back to my channel my name is Faye if you're new here it has been a hot minute since I've picked up this camera and I've vlogged or if honestly I posted anything on YouTube so welcome back I mean if you do follow me like hello um but yeah I just thought I was kind of in the mood to vlog today and I thought why not I'm actually in Tampa right now as you can see I'm at Gannon's place um we just got back from a vacation in hilton head south carolina which was so amazing um we went with gannon's family so if you're watching this thank you that was awesome it was the best but yeah i am in my workout clothes um it's like 10 o'clock right now i've been packing up my bag i when gannon left for work i was gonna go down to the gym i got there and my phone was dead and I was like, mm, no, can't work out without my phone because I need music and stuff like that. So I came back up, let my phone charge, and was packing up my bag a little bit because I think I'm going to leave today. Today is Wednesday. Um, but yeah, look at this, you guys. I um, have an e-brace on. You're probably wondering, what the heck? Um... I don't really know what's wrong with my knee. I heard it in college and I never got it checked out and that was literally, oh gosh, I don't even wanna say, like six years ago. And I just never did anything about it. And here we are today. My knee, I can't like walk without it hurting. And Gannon and I have been doing these health rules. If you guys have heard of the 75 hard, it's, that's not where we got the idea, but after I started doing it, I was like, oh, this is kind of like 75 hard, but it's not. We made up our own rules, just like realistic to our lifestyle. So we are both doing 10,000 steps a day, which is probably why my knee hurts so bad. Um, but we're doing 10,000 steps a day. I'm doing 100 ounces of water a day at very minimum. Um, I've been doing like 120, so almost like a gallon, but at minimum 100 ounces and then I'm reading twice a week and doing at minimum like four workouts in the gym um, per week and that's just to like easy simple rules that I can follow even on my busiest weeks on my busiest days I can still get 10,000 steps and drink 100 ounces of water and with seven days in a week I think four is very realistic um, I used to be a workout like fiend and I used to work out seven days a week um and then I completely fell off like honestly when Gannon and I started dating we just like you know when you get a new boyfriend and you're like oh this is fun and you just kind of whatever so we're back on our grind almost three years later and yeah so we're gonna go to the gym I have to get my workout in um we started this on Sunday and I've so far worked out Monday, Tuesday, and today is Wednesday. So I've gotten my water in and I've gotten my steps in each day. Um, this is day three of workouts and I think I'm going to read today. So I think I might go down to the pool. It's actually the first sunny day in Florida. And honestly, vacation was a little bit cloudy and rainy too. So I might go down to the pool to read a little bit and then I think I'm heading home today, but I'm not sure. So this is a very long intro, I apologize, but let's get into my day. Dark. I've never seen you clearer than that. Flying high, floating somewhere up in the clouds. Going out of ourselves, can we feel it? Almost like I don't know if it's real Cause when we're doing our thing with the wheels that won't stop turning So take me on a trip, 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 nah Trip, trip, trip Oh, I flick the switch, kill the lights Oh, I wasted City lights are shining so bright All these empty faces We don't care about them tonight Oh 
a LaCroix, popcorn, carrots, uh, these vegan like cauliflower cheese it cracker things, a cookie, two sandwiches, olives, and uh, uh, pickles. He said he was hungry. So that's what he's getting. Oh, and his Aetna information. Okay. I mean, he was... Mm. Mm. Oh, I switched water cups. This is 25 ounces because I had my protein shake. Oh, here he comes. I had my protein shake out of that other cup and I need to clean it. So this is actually better. Hi, cheeky butt. How are you doing, baby? Good, how are you? That's pretty. Oh, I love your hat. Thanks. Ooh, that's ripping. Try to not have your stuff spill in there so you can take that back home. Oh wow. Well, wow. yeah, those Vitarains were in my car. I didn't want them in here anymore. Oh. So just leave them up there. Also, I packed you a lot of stuff like I did yesterday That's and a honey mustard because I don't know if I put enough sauce on it. You're the best. Gannon just um, tried to turn around and blow me a kiss and his glasses flew off his face. <laughs> I really wish I got that on camera at all. He's so cute. Um, can I please have the oven roasted turkey breast? Yeah, whatever like the normal is. Not like super thick, but not like paper thin. Okay. Yeah, that's perfect. Thank you. Thank you so much. Guys, it is only 2.30. And I have passed my 10,000 steps. I'm at 10,053. That's what we love to see. We love to see it. And this is why I love morning workouts so much because I'm also in such a good mood right now. Like, I, oh, I'm having like the best little day. I just feel like I'm in such a good mood. And Gannon was kind of having a tough day at work and he, whoa. And he even said like, oh, you're just like, I'm loving your vibe right now. And I'm like, thanks. And these cars are kind of, yeah, he's like, I'm, I'm loving your vibe. This is putting me in a better mood. And um, so yeah, I just thought I would, I don't know if you guys can like feel this through the screen, but if you're having a tough day and you're like laying in bed, watching YouTube videos because you're sad and you're feeling lazy and you just like feel like flat and like meh today that's okay i've been there multiple times and youtube is the one thing that really helps me get through it so like i get you i feel you i feel you but tomorrow is a new day and guess what you can why is my car not working what is happening Tomorrow is a new day and you can get up and if you are capable, go for a walk. Just go for a walk. 
if you can go to the gym go to the gym if not just go for a walk just move your body in some type of way if you have an injury move the part of your body that's not injured if you whatever it might be read a little book read an article read something that makes you feel good drink lots of water and say some positive affirmations i think that will help you a lot also don't go on social media the first thing in the morning i'm telling you like i didn't do that today and i'm like having the best day and i do that every morning and i feel like such a bum every day so just realness to realness you know what i'm saying but okay anyways i just went to walmart and i got more lunch meat because i used all the lunch meat for gannon sandwiches and i'm kind of getting back to my if you know you know my st louis diet which isn't really a diet, it's more of like a lifestyle, but I was basically paleo and I used to have lettuce wraps for lunch every day and they're so good. They taste so good and like, I love them. So I just do like living lettuce. They're like little lettuce cups with turkey and sometimes I do hot sauce and vegan ranch or sometimes I do um, mayo and mustard and I think I'm gonna do both today. Sometimes I put a little piece of turkey bacon in them. Sometimes I do the vegan cauliflower cheese it's in there because it's delicious but all right i'm gonna go upstairs i'm gonna make that and then i'm gonna figure out what we're eating for dinner and go to whole foods and get the ingredients okay so oh my gosh my hair looks crazy um it's 5 30. i accidentally fell asleep on the couch after i ate because i'm like exhausted right now i mean i like woke up early and worked out and did all that stuff today but I don't know why I'm so tired. Maybe I need more water in my life. Um, I know I don't have to do this but I like to have the house clean when Gannon gets home. Even though it's mainly like his mess but I just think it's nice for him. Um, so I'm gonna clean and then I need to go to Whole Foods because I was gonna have dinner ready when Kenny got home at six o'clock and now it's five. Um, that's okay, he has to work out still. Okay, I'm gonna go. Okay, so I'm home from, actually let me turn the TV off. Um, I'm home, well, <laughs> home. I'm back at Gannon's um, from grocery shopping and I don't know how I spent $63 at Whole Foods but I thought I'd do a mini grocery haul. Even though this is kind of like basically just for what we need for dinner, I grabbed a couple other things too, so I thought I would show you. And there's one thing I'm very excited about that I haven't been able to find anywhere else. So I'm very excited. Okay, so I'm just gonna start over here. Um, these, I've had these before, I love these. They are, I'm pretty sure this one's vegan. Um, I know they're gluten-free, but this one's kind of like, a crunch bar it has um, like the crispy rice in it so these are really good stark chocolates dairy-free um, love those that's like perfect for a little sweet tooth at night just have like one it's so rich that you can just have like one little tiny piece of it and you're good to go um, I've been loving this turkey sausage lately I still have some in the fridge but thought might as well freeze it, it was on sale um, it's really good and it has pretty good ingredients for like bacon. I, just, I said sausage, I mean bacon, turkey bacon. Um, you can screenshot that, but it's very like minimal ingredients. I just got chicken breast for tonight, bonza spaghetti. Um, I know that typically like a pasta that I'm making tonight is like the little spiral noodles, but I honestly don't really like those noodles. So I prefer these ones. So that's what I got. Um, I got the basil pesto. I, I wanted to get the dairy free one because that's the whole reason I went to Whole Foods was to get dairy free pesto and they didn't have it. I couldn't find it anywhere, honestly. I didn't really vlog in there because it was pretty chaotic and I've never been to that one before and I didn't know where anything was and I was just kind of like stressed, so sorry about that. And then everybody talks about this. They say it's amazing. Um, I love oat milk, so I'm excited to try this. Um, because I'm a, I'm a big almond milk girl, 
too but I'm allergic to actual almonds. Processed almonds I can do, like I can do almond butter and almond milk, but for some reason I drank almond milk the other day and I got really bad allergies from it. Like my ears were itchy and my throat started to itch and stuff and it kind of freaked me out. So I decided I would try this. I've heard great things, so we'll see if this is worth the hype. Um, I just got some brown eggs. This is for the dinner tonight. Um, and then these are so, Gannon loves, whoa. Gannon loves cream soda, so I got this one for him, and I prefer root beer, so I got this one for me. But it's zero calorie, um, it's zero calorie pop, and they taste just like pop and soda, whatever you guys say. I'm from Michigan, I say pop. So yeah, I like, I don't like to buy the six pack because I don't necessarily need them, but I'm thinking if I stay in Tampa tomorrow and we watch the game tomorrow night, we can either finish the chili or have pizza or something and we can have these with that since it's healthy pop <laughs> um this is from Publix Gannon needed this I needed some little olive oil Josh for tonight and then this is for Gannon's sandwiches tomorrow that's all from Publix um this is from Whole Foods got this for tonight's dinner got this for sandwiches and tonight's dinner um got these for smoothies or my shakes um, zucchini and squash for tonight's dinner. This is just for a snack for tomorrow. Um, and then also got this for tonight's dinner. So I'm gonna use the asparagus, zucchini, squash, um, tomatoes. Oh, that's what I needed to get. Peppers, I really wanted peppers. Maybe we have some in the fridge, if not, Dang it, I really wanted peppers. That's what I, I knew I was forgetting something. I know we have onion in the fridge. I'll just add onion in. It is what it is, not a big deal. And then, are you guys ready? I'm so excited. Bam! I have not been able to find a spaghetti squash anywhere. Like, anywhere. And if you guys have, please let me know. If you live in the Tampa area or Fort Myers area, freaking let me know what it is because this is the first time I've been able to find spaghetti squash, I swear, in like a year. They never have it at Publix. Thank God Whole Foods had it. They had a ton of them. Um, so yeah, this is everything I got. It was like $80. So that's good. The only reason I went to Whole Foods is because I was wanted the dairy-free pesto and didn't even get it. So looks like we're having dairy tonight. It is what it is. Um, but yeah that's it and for a little update i only need one more of these bad boys and i'm done for all my check marks for the day so i'll definitely get that in but yeah i'm gonna start cooking and gannon's at the gym so he should be back soon maybe i'll try to set you guys up so you can cook with me Okay, so I have um, asparagus, squash, zucchini, onion, and mushroom sauteing in here with some spices and uh, olive oil. I have the noodles boiling over here, and then the chicken is cooking in the oven. It sh Whoa. It should be done soon. Um, I'm about to add tomatoes and spinach into the um, vegetables to kind of warm those up a little bit and then I should be able to mix everything together in a little. Mine doesn't look as cute as Gannon's so that's why I'm showing you Gannon's. We are gonna watch the last two episodes of New Girl. Um, so I think I'm gonna end off the vlog here. I had so much fun vlogging today. I had like such a good day. And I just want to take a couple of minutes and like kind of reflect with you guys. Also, I'm on my last cup of water. So let's grab that and finish that. Well, I'm going to finish it with dinner too. But I just have to say like I have been kind of in a rut lately. Obviously, like I have not been active on Instagram or YouTube, which is not really normal for me. I just in so much like the type of person that if i have a million things to do i get so much more more done in the day and if i don't really have anything to do it's like it's so hard for me to do the tasks i need to do and i think that 
today was a really good day because I woke up, I got a really good workout in, and I like felt like I had purpose for the day now, um, especially with these rules. It's like I have to make sure that I'm getting my steps in. I have to make sure that I'm drinking water. I have to make sure that I'm reading and doing all this stuff. And I don't know. It's just like this book I'm reading, it's, I'll link it below. Um, I don't know where it's at right now, but it's called You Are a Badass. And it's just basically, it's really good for um, like if you are going through a change in your life or if you are ready to like stop doing the mundane things that you're doing every day and try something different it's a really good book for that um or if you're kind of in a rut definitely i definitely suggest reading it it put me in the best mood today and yeah i don't know i think i'm gonna do like a sit down life update because i just have so much to talk about um i ended up quitting my job in January, or January, in June, July, June, July. My last day was July 22nd. And um, that's why I've been on the job hunt, as you guys know. But yeah, I just, it's been day to day, like me having to do my own thing and figure it out and like find a job and do what I need to do. Um, so I really just wanna take some time to like sit down and like, Put my thoughts together and then do like a sit down chat with a life update but yeah i had a really good day today i'm glad i ended up vlogging because it was like such a good day and i hope you guys enjoy this vlog if you do make sure you subscribe and like this um leave a comment down below if you're still watching because i would love to know like who watches my videos until the end um and also Comment your rules down below if you decide to make some because that's really interesting and I want to know about that. Uh, also, follow me on Instagram. I don't know if I already said that. Yeah. Have a good day, guys. Love you. Go drink your water.